So, uh, please answer the questions as clear as possible. Mm -hmm. yeah. um, okay. So, um, who are you? Um, I am Natalie. Natalie? Yeah. yeah. Um, can you give me some background about yourself? Natalie? Yeah. Um, I am from El Salvador and I have uh, two years living here in the United States. Um, what is your home country again? El Salvador. So, uh, did you come with your parents? What country did you yes. Come yes. Yes. I'm from Russia. Russia? Oh, yeah. Russia. What, um, what part of Russia? Moscow. Um, what part of El Salvador did you come from? Um, San Salvador. Moscow. San Salvador. When did you come to the U.S.? Uh, about two years ago. Two years? Uh, two years. Uh, so, what kind of things were there in Moscow? Mm -hmm. What kind of uh, things were there in Moscow? Uh, there um, is there, um, why did you leave, oh, do you have any brothers or sisters? Yes, I have two sisters. Um, do they come with you? Yes. Is there uh, any other reasons that you left your home country? I leave my home country. Uh, why did you leave your home country? Um, I leave my home country because my my grandpa gave the papers to my parents so we can have a better education. So you came here for your education? Yeah. Do you, uh, do you like your education here? Yes. Uh, okay. My mom got to work here. Uh, and what did she do? Is there any other reasons that you left your own country? Oh, um, no. No? No. Um, how did you get here? How do I get? Um, airplane. Yeah. Oh, why did you know? Uh, was it easy leaving your home country and your home behind? No, it was, um, it was hard because I will leave the most, most important thing that my family because here I don't so have like too much family. Like, uh, um, come to is there anything else that, that's, that, yeah, you, that you wish you, you wouldn't leave behind? Yes. Um, no. No? no. Just your family? Yeah. Um, when you got here, was it easy adjusting to the American culture? No, because... Um, it was it wasn't easy because I had to learn the like, new language, I had to learn the new cultures here, and meet new people. Just meet new people? Yeah. Um, just well, me and my mom, uh, but then my brother. Did you already speak mom. English when you came here? No. 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 Did you or your parents um, believe in the American dream? Like when you say came along like all no. together, or just no? No. Separately. Separately. Well, why not? Um, why not? Like I was saying, like two. <laughs> Do you know what the American dream is? Hmm? Do you know what the American dream is? No. Um, the American so, like, dream was it different is something where like, like, yeah. you, could, like you have like the freedom mm -hmm. yeah you all do, do, what, do what you can mm -hmm. in America so do you believe in America do you believe in America like, yeah I believe um, it was really um, shit this is too short for us like I like were there um, any Challenges or whatever, yeah, there was like school. I was challenged in school and stuff, and like talking because I like make friends, I guess, because I couldn't talk. But um, because I mean, it was easier to learn how to because I learned English, so it was okay. Did you have to uh, take like some, some other When you like, left your country, how old were you at the time? I had a tutor. How, how old were you? Was, yeah. um, I was like 11. Um, how were the conditions in the country when you left? Um, there were, the conditions were like too bad because the economy was bad and there was like too much buildings. Too many buildings? Yeah. Okay, well in America. <laughs> don't, you, don't, you, don't you think there's too many buildings here? Three what? Don't, don't you think there's too many buildings in here? No. No? Um, how did you prepare for your trip here? For my um, for my field trip. No, no, how, how, how did you prepare for your trips here in America? For my trip, um, 
have I want to have saying goodbye to family, pack up your bags, things like that. Yeah. Is there anything else like that? No. No, just anything else. My friends. You say goodbye to your friends? Uh-huh. Yeah. Like, what, what had to change when you come over here? Like, Who came with you when you immigrated? Yeah, like, uh, Who came with me? Yeah. My parents and my two sisters. Who did you leave behind? Oh, uh, my grandma. Your grandmother? Anyone else? Uh, my uncle. I guess. Um, just them. Uh, what did you leave behind? In different food. I leave behind like, you, um, my friends. Do you still like make Russian food here? No? Um, huh? how, uh, oh yes. Okay, how did you get here? I did get I get here like by iron plane with yeah. yeah. Did you stay somewhere else before arriving here? No. No. His, no. his mom used to make them and Why did you choose the United States? Why not some other country? Um, I choose the United States because I think that there's like more opportunities and better education. Okay. Uh, do you like the education here in the United States? Yes. What, what, what would you say it was uh, how, how it's better than the education you got here? The education is more better because I think like teachers here like more attendant to the students and in my home country teachers don't care about about the students. Okay. Yeah. Like you never heard of the American dream. Who who decided you who decided you would come here? My parents and my my father learned English. Um, did he want to leave? No, I didn't want to leave. Yeah. Okay. Was it like a? How did others in your home country treat you when they knew you were leaving? Treat me? Yeah. Like they were like they were sad, like your friends, family. Yeah, my friends and my family they were treated. Oh, they're angry at you because you're going to. So yeah. <laughs> Do you have like any expectations at all, or? Um, what changes in, in lifestyle did you make when you came here? Have any expectations? What changes? I've been in lots um, of I think like so my personality. What country is it? How did that change? Um, I live in the Oh, uh, because uh, in my country, in my home country, I was like, uh, like more angry, and here like I'm not like too much shy. I haven't seen Chicago yet. Huh? You haven't seen New York and Chicago. No. What other places? Russian. Because I lived in Russia. What was your first impression of the United States? My first impression was like there were like more organized street people. So I like more res they respect more. Has this initial impression impression changed over time? So did your mom like no? no. Like how did she get the job and what are some of the differences and similarities you notice in the cultures here and and in your home country? Uh, some similarities are like she went, she, he's a doctor, so she went to like, uh, like and then um, she just like kinda liked it, so and then she applied. I don't know, I think that uh, some schools and some difference are like here I'm here the um, I don't know how to say the rules. Oh, the, the laws, laws? Yeah, laws. the laws are, are here to like, um, to respect them. And in my home country, they were laws, but they don't respect. They don't. I don't know. Yeah. They, so you're saying that, that the laws in your home country were not as upheld uh -huh. so as laws in the United States of America. Which one yeah. Um, it's more similar. Really? Yeah. What are your hopes for yourself and or your family when you came here? My hopes for me was like to get a better education and for my family was to get a good job. Have you realized these hopes? 
Um, yes. Oh, I know. Like, how is it simpler than other countries? Um, well, because, like, you don't... So, in Russia and other countries... How are you treated now um, in America different from how you were treated when you first arrived in the United States? Um, not in, not as I don't know. Laws or restrictions? Do you want me to uh, clarify? Yeah. Okay. So, how are you treated now as a person in the United States? As um as when you first arrived, like do people think different of you when you first arrived. Like oh yeah. Or or like now where they think you're a cool person. Yeah. yeah, the first time I came here, they think that I was like a shy person. But now they think that I am a cool person. Yeah. Okay. Were your expectations of coming to America met? Hmm? Were your expectations of coming here to America met? Sexual person. Can you clear? So when you when you came to America, did you have any expectations when you got there? Like any any hopes? Yeah. And what were those? Yeah. What were those? Um, my hopes. Like unless you really know the space. No, like like what were your expectations like? To be like a like a nice like up up upholding place. Did you ever go to the No. I don't, I don't have any expectations. You, you didn't have any expectations when you came here? No. Um, um, was your idea of America the same as uh, the reality? No. No? No. Can you, can you uh, go in depth? But then, um, like when you when you came to America, did you, did you think something different when you came here? Like, if I take... No, when you, when you came here to America, but then, um, yeah. when, you, when you first came here to America, did you, did you think of something different? Like it was going to be like, like everyone was happy? Oh, I think like, when I... Right, and, but when you, when, when you like really came here, it was all different? Yeah. It was? So what, what was your idea before you came here? Oh, like to be like... The places will be like more organized. Um, people will be responsible, respectful, and so was it like, yeah. It's kind of like difficult or like weird okay. to um, move to country to country. Or no. Um, can you tell me about the schools so, in your home country? Yeah. Um, the schools in my home country, they were like, um, um, like they were like small. They don't have like good, good desk. And that teachers, they didn't teach really good. So, yeah, teachers are good. Yeah. Um, did you did you feel that you have a better opportunity here than in uh, El Salvador? Yes, I think. Can you explain? Yes, um, I think I have like a better opportunity here because um, I think I was gonna go to Aragon, but then I think in my my home country there were like not much opportunities because. Um, they, there in my home country, there wasn't a good education. Yeah, and I don't know. There were like people who didn't give jobs to another person there because they don't go to, to college or school. Okay. So how 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 did uh. How does working here in America differ from working in um, I think it's working different because I feel like more more safe here than in my home country. Um, can you go on depth about that? Um, yeah, sure. Like, when, when I was in my home country, there were like the gangs. They were in the hallways. So what do you want to do? Around like from, from I don't know how to say. Um, can you speak up? Yes. Yeah. Hmm? Can you speak up? Because I'm trying to get the phone. Okay. They were like around the neighborhood, so they were like not too much safe. They always try to. 
to take out the things of the person, something like that. Like kill people? Yeah. yeah. Do you, um, why do you feel more safe here then? I feel like more safe here because I can go to any place. I can go to any place so and there will be like, no, I will not be like, worry about what will happen to me. Yeah. What do you mean? Like, uh, like, because um, like, you've been to Paris. Was there any, like, Russia, law enforcement like, in your country? Like, go somewhere else? Wrong what? Any law enforcement, like, the police? Well, I was, like, I didn't um, yeah. care. No worries? Mm -hmm. Okay. But, um, so they didn't, they didn't really do their job. Before, mm -hmm. They didn't really do their job. Like, did you ever, no. like, think about it? As in, like, as in, like, right. here, okay. compared to, like, what? No. Yeah. Um, what do you... What do your parents think of um, America? They think like he's here is like a nice place and a safe place and a place with opportunities. Okay. Yeah. So. <laughs> oh, okay. So. Think of something. Um, thank you for your time. It was uh, much, much appreciated. Okay, thank you. Right. Oh,